Yo, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Slope Podcast. It's a podcast about Sakamichi series idols. I'm Zaka46. Zaka Zaka46. Hinata Zaka46. And Yoshimoto Zaka46. I'm Boy, and I'm here with Josh. We are pretty casual fans of Sakamichi series and idols in general. And uh, yeah, we come together every Tuesdays around 7 on Twitch dot tv slash slow club to just chat about sakamichi series you know shoot the very shit, good josh i enjoyed that intro boy hey thank you how you uh, how you been how are you i've been all right i've been all right uh finally got my my second dose oh my second vaccine it's time for Today. korean barbecue dude Ooh, i still have to wait for my the rest of my family to get their second one so it might be a little bit for me but yeah, let's, let's, uh, Jimmy and Boy are gonna experiment first, and see how it goes. They might uh, mm-hmm. they might like call me in or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But uh, we'll we'll see, man. We'll see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm I'm uh, excited. I think I lost my the <laughs> card that said that's the. Proof. <laughs> how did you lose it? <laughs> <laughs> I like had it in my pocket somewhere, uh, uh-huh. and then. Did you at least take know. a picture of it? I don't know where it is, to be honest. So I'm, I'm well, pretty much as good as not vaccinated. Even is it in your it like history? January. Is it in your records? It should be if I like go to work or whatever. They can oh, okay, probably okay. look that shit up. But okay, okay. It's, it's here somewhere. I've been like reorganizing and cleaning my, my mm-hmm, room. Mm-hmm. So <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> You're gonna find oh, yeah. it like, like, like inside, of, like stuck, like inside of a fan on your computer. For how to get here? Yeah, dude. Or like behind something. I don't know. Yeah. Under a. Carpet. You're gonna open up that know. Kiyakizaka poster and then just like look inside and be oh. like, "Oh, here it is." How did this end up here? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's always one. But of yeah, things. cool, cool, dude. It's time for <laughs> for Korean barbecue. Right. It's been so long. How long has it been? It's been more than a year. That's for More sure. than eight, yeah. Mm-hmm. Cause the last time we hung out in person was, was when? Was it that day we got boba or afterwards? I don't even remember. I think it might be that day. Like we we shot a video which was the the, that's on the the channel now where we try to predict the the. Send butts for me. Oh yeah, that was the last time. Yeah. For Kiyakizaka. Was that the last time? Yeah, that was the last time. That was the last time. Wow. Yeah. We, we recorded not even like two anymore. other videos that was gonna be a series. We were like all amped up for it to be a series. <laughs> but then everything happened. And now we had to scrap idea, those ideas. Yeah, mm-hmm. it, you'll never see it. Because uh-huh. I deleted those files because it was taking up space on my PC. <laughs> 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 They're gone forever. Unless uh, uh. Jimmy or Josh still has the raws in there. I think I have like I one of them. Oh, okay. I don't have the oh. other ones though. And it's kind of important to have all of them for the whole series. Yeah. Maybe we'll, we'll do it with another thing. Yeah. yeah. But um, all right. soon, maybe more content will come that's yeah. in person and better. I want spring break. I've been chilling. How's that going? Just playing Monster Hunter. I was, I'm not. I'm not. Jimmy isn't here, so I can't yeah. lean in too much in this I conversation. I played with Jimmy a little bit. Uh-huh. You know, uh, be a little bit, being three hours. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> um, the other night, it was. It's pretty cool. It's all on the same platform, so and like all the people yeah. I know who play Monster Hunter, we can actually play together now. Mm-hmm. So that's nice. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, what else is new? I, th- I think that's it. Uh, all oh, we know me. is school and work. Oh, you have something else? The Ever Given was dislodged from the canal. Yeah. Give oh, it up okay. <laughs> for international trade. All right. <laughs> now, we, now we can get some oil. <laughs> so the gas That's one of like, so the high. funniest things I think I've, I've seen. I don't know. Uh, Just the ship stuck mm. in the canal. It's Just like, stops well, everything. <laughs> all the goods, like billions mm-hmm. of dollars worth. <laughs> <clears throat> exactly. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> mm-hmm. oh, we have a new That's video that was released. Thing. Oh, it's um, 
an album discussion on Eyes yes. One. Oh, that's right. Yeah. That was me. Went ahead and listened to the album Twelve, which is the only ja- <coughs> the only Japanese release that mm-hmm. Eyes One did. And yeah, we listened to it. It was it's me, Josh, and Tron. Because Tron is yes. out of like all the Slope Club guys, he's like the biggest Eyes One fan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or I guess he he's the only one that really cares about that. <laughs> I mean, that's true. I mean, it, it is technically uh, the biggest, you know. Yeah, yeah. So uh, to listen to that, because you know, Eyes One's uh, actually disbanding uh, very soon, right? Yeah, sometime in the next couple weeks or whatever. In this year. <laughs> this year, I don't know. Well, I mean, it seems like they made it official. I don't know. They had like their yeah. last concert or whatever. Sakura Nobody uploaded follows, a video so. on her YouTube channel. Mm. That kind of sealed it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so... Uh, I mean, I guess everyone should have known. <laughs> right? I mean, yeah. hey, we said we were going to disband after like two years. <laughs> Where are y'all mad? This we is are. exactly what we said. Uh, yeah. I think people were hopeful that they would continue, but... Uh, I guess they, they stuck with their, with their stuff. Popular and that... Um, that it would just like yeah we're gonna keep going because they're popular or yeah 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 mm-hmm. well, I guess. but uh, yeah you know. I agree like some some fans were disappointed because like they couldn't see them live for what last time or whatever and, you know, mm-hmm. that sucks yeah um, it's kind of like you know Kiaki last thing, live yeah. had no audience yeah. either so it's like ah well that sucks for mm-hmm. the Kiaki mm-hmm. fans but at least yeah. should I should my concert no, no audience <laughs> <laughs> yeah so Kiaki is still around in some in, in one way or another. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Whereas Eyes One is just like, members go do their own thing now. So. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. But yeah, check out the uh, review for mm-hmm. that one. It's a discussion, not a review. Oh, that's Even right. though we, wait, we review it at the end. Should we just rename it it's to a review? It's a discussion and review. <laughs> I feel like review, more people will look for than discussion. Mm hmm. Hmm. But uh, yeah, let us know what you thought of that album if you've listened to it mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and stuff like that. Go ahead and leave a comment on those. Yeah. But uh, right. anyway, let's get into get some into of the Sakamichi stuff this week. Um, first off, we got the Shilling Corner and what it's is a it? new Cup Star Takeover Ooh. commercial from Hinata Zaka. Um, I think we talked about it last week or two weeks ago sometime. Um, mm-hmm. Hinata Zaka is doing the, I guess, like the sequel, I guess, to this Cup Star series that Nogi Zaka started, right? Like the school mm-hmm. setting or whatever. Um, yeah, this had like Osaka Mayan and stuff, school. right? This is way back. Some this ramen. campaign. Um, oh, my internet went down. But yeah, this time, instead of Nogi... It's going to be Hinata Zaka. Yep, we see ah, Kosaka eating some ramen at school. Yep, um, Katoshi's there. Yeah. Oh, there's another video under it. Yeah, so like the first uh, part, I guess, is Kosaka now um, mm-hmm. with the cup ramen. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Looks like a school setting. She's eating outside. Hey. Come through. I'm eating Cup Star. And you know. <laughs> mm. If you see some Cup Star, you have to go. Right? It's not, it's not, oh shit, Kosaka now. It's, it's oh shit, <laughs> Cup Star. Exactly. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, yeah, mm-hmm. so you have that now. Hinata uh-huh, is uh-huh. uh it's taken over for both of the for both of them. They use the same songs. Do they only have like one license or something? <laughs> we have to use this entire thing. Our budget, <laughs> right? Hey, we wasted well. it all. We bought all this, you know. So uh, it's pretty long, actually. It's like two minutes. The uh-huh. uh, Kosaka now little skit clip thing, whatever. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So uh, yeah, she talks. Cup <laughs> she holds holds good. ramen. <laughs> I don't know. It is what it uh, is. I mean, that's as much as it gives us. So, mm-hmm. yeah. So, uh, I don't. I don't know if Nogi's gonna come back, or, or if their shit's done. 
no announcements. Oh wait, wait. Is this a new thing? Oh, it's just released fresh off the press. No, no, we no, we oh, watched this oh, one before. Oh, okay. No, but it said new. Well, it's it's the Asuka one we've seen already. Oh, okay. So okay. never mind. Yeah, uh, I'm yeah. hoping that you know at the end of the Hinata Zaka one. They go into a collaboration between the two groups. Mm. Crossover event. Mm -hmm. Or maybe, you know, they could go with Sakura Saka. You never know. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe Yoshimoto Zaka? Oh. Yeah. I mean, it's going to be a fairly long campaign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Nogi's been endorsing Cup Star for a long time. A long time. So. I, think, I think we were filming a video and then there was... It was at, uh, what is it, the one where Jimmy worked at? Uh, Annie. Annie. Fest? Fest. Yes. Yeah, we, we made a video. We, yeah, yeah, we, we saw the the brand. We're like, oh, is this the Nogi stuff? Ah, oh, no, who is this guy? No, we had Iron <laughs> Chef Morimoto on uh -huh. instead. It wasn't Nogi Zaka. Uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> and then we complained to Jimmy. Yeah. But that part got cut out. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that's the Cup Star commercials, uh, Hinata Zaka. Let's get into the current events. Yo, oh. Yoshimoto Zaka, there's some news actually this week, but it's not really good news. There's oh. a graduation announcement oh, no. from Yoshimoto Zaka, 46 member Tech. Which one is this um, one? He is a second gen. Already? Uh, Yoshimoto Zaka, yeah. They haven't even done anything. <laughs> I know. Maybe he's like, yo, man, I got in this group, did stuff for like two months, COVID uh -huh. happened. Mm. <laughs> now they ain't doing Born anything. 2002, so that would mean... So he's he's like 16, he's a young kid. 2002? Um, is his profile. He's like in a... Isn't he like... He's I'm like in a dance crew mind. called Oops. Oops. Or something like that. But, I did it again. Yeah. You know, Britney Spears. But yeah, mm -hmm. they are all under Yoshimoto. Right? That's like their agency. And so he auditioned. He got in because of his dancing skills. Mm. Oh, he's he's 18 now. I'm, I'm thinking of that, when that, he that's joined. What I, that's what I felt like. Okay. I was, I was, yeah, yeah, I was thinking like, you know, when they profile the people when uh, on the TV shows, it's like, oh, look at Tech. He's 16. Mm. But that was like two years ago. <laughs> that's how long it's been. So they haven't done anything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So yeah, he graduated like high school. He's like, yo, what am I doing in this group? They're not even doing anything. Right? He's like, all right, I'm Damn leaving. It. I'm going to go to university. Screw this. Mm. Does that mean he's so. leaving Yoshimoto or just Yoshimoto Zaka? Uh, on this thing, um, on the article thing, it says he's, he's leaving Show Title, which is an agency under Yoshimoto, I think. Oh, okay. And inter like, he, and so he's also leaving, leaving Yoshimoto. Interesting. Yeah, he's a young guy, man. So he, can do yeah, he has he the wants. options, you know. Your dreams. Follow your dreams. I mean, he has that like one year shadow band, but you know. Oh, man. Come on. He's only 18, man. <laughs> Just let him go to university. Yeah, that's fine. You right. know? He could go to school and then by the time he graduates or whatever, he Just come back. Whatever. Uh -huh. Come back to entertainment if he wants. Yeah, but, exactly. Uh, yeah. Good luck to you, dude. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Let's go to Hinata Zaka news. Oh. We have young Nibu Chan lending her vocal talents to a oh. movie. <laughs> Is she a goblin? Um, like a little... I don't know. Uh, oh. Well, so it says here, uh, Nibu is going to be in the anime Demo the Movie. Uh, providing some voice talent. Uh, mm. There's a trailer for it here um it's a animated movie oh this page isn't loading okay here we go looks like a kids movie um, why well, like slenderman there I, I know absolutely nothing about this looks like cg yeah. Action. At least it looks better than that one other show we were looking at yesterday. Oh, X Arm? Oh man. X Arm. Yeah. <laughs> and this looks pretty good actually, right? Like for yeah. the CG style. Uh-huh. Uh, -huh. uh Nibu's like one minute-ish around there. I guess one her character is this masked oh, person. Okay. 
Oh, that, that was a serious sounding Nibu. It wasn't a gremlin sounding mm-hmm. Nibu. Yeah. <laughs> and that's what I was expecting. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, maybe uh, go check it out, you know? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Good, jo- good job. She's not the first Hinata member I thought would get mm-hmm. a voice acting role. <laughs> Who would you get as a oh, voice God. acting role then? Hmm. Kyonk, let's go. <laughs> Just hey, yo, the up? deep voice, like <laughs> villain. Yo, what up, man? What's going on with you? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm just biased because she's my OG. But oh, okay. No, but I, I, I could see that for like a, a character like gets like evil or something, and then the voice gradually gets deeper. Mm. That would be cool. Like first speaking your idol voice, then go to your regular voice. There we go. Chat saying Ushio. I think Ushio mm. is actually the one who wants like voice work, right? Like narration uh-huh. or whatever. She's a very like cutesy voice, right? Mm. Sounds she can sound like a nice Onesan type of mm-hmm. voice. Yeah. yeah, um, yeah. But uh, yeah, that is uh, Nibu Chan. Hinata has some announcements also this week. They are starting a new drama called Koe Haru. Will begin April twenty eighth, um, and it looks like not all of them are gonna be starring. Mm. It's just uh, Mipan, who is the main character, and Nibu and Bemiho and Osushi and so on and so forth. I have the. Uh, uh, I wonder why it's not everyone. Website. Maybe it's just a story. This, yeah, with less it's people. It ties into the Nibu's Nibu's work because it's about voice acting. <laughs> they like Mipan wants to be a voice actor, and so does everybody else. Look, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. look at that. This you know, Nibu like shot looks like from where, like she uh, recorded the stuff for the movie. <laughs> Just two, <laughs> two birds with one stone, dude. There we go. <laughs> All right, you doing that? All right. <laughs> Let's ask him real quick. We could borrow the studio to record the rest of our stuff. All right, we're done. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. So, uh, let's see, I guess, the cast here. Not all of them. Maybe some will make cameos, but, uh, yeah. Yeah, you want to get these like nine people for now? Yeah. So, Akipi, of course, producer, as usual. Mm-hmm. Is he also the writer? Or is there uh, someone else? I think... What does this kanji say? <laughs> Just Google Translate. <laughs> uh, original work. Maybe the, like the original ideas is, but he didn't write the script. Oh, okay. okay. So. <laughs> what if they're voice acting? There we go. Write it down. Original <laughs> idea. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We'll see, I see, guess. See, so, so right now I say like... Oh, uh, they should be in a scary TV show. There we go. Now, if they do a scary TV show, original idea, Joshua Ramos. There we go. Bam. Done. Look you at that. Flesh it, it out more, there. dude. <laughs> no, no, just just the original idea. You know. I just you came came to me just now. <laughs> you know. I'm gonna pen that one. <laughs> My talents, you know, just can't control it. Mm-hmm. sometimes I have to say it out loud. <laughs> um, I maybe I'll check this out. I don't know. I. Kind of like Dasara, like the first half of it, at least. Oh, was the second half not as good? Uh, just kind of like... <clears throat> just, oh, okay. Like nothing... nothing. It imp- felt like they tried to, to cram three episodes worth into one. So like towards the end, Dasara got super rushed. Mm. There was like a time okay. skip or whatever. And like, I don't know, man. Mm, interesting. But you know, if you're a Hinata fan, you probably want to check this out. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, April twenty eighth, Koi. Let's keep going. More Hinata stuffs. Um, I didn't know about this fifth... next one. Oh, they announced their fifth single. <laughs> I didn't know. I don't know Kimishika why I didn't know about this. Katan is the title. It'll be released May twenty sixth. Um, usual limited. Type A, B, C, and D in a regular type. Mm-hmm. Um, 
Oh, yeah, I have heard yeah. about this because of this. Get photos. Of the last bit. And stuff like that. It's pretty usual stuff. Um, no further uh, info on it. They only announced it at the concert, but I don't think mm -hmm. they actually performed it. I didn't watch the concert, so I don't know. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, so like, there, there's no like Senbats lineup. I don't know who the center is. Mm -hmm. Maybe Chat knows. Um, I think people were guessing it was Meepun. Meepun, okay. Yeah, which I might tie into their I'm, drama. I accept. Yeah, I would like that too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Just because yeah, it's somebody else. Exactly. I mean, Meepun was the center for the album, but you know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yeah, since you know, gotta she's give her like the main the character of the, single. of the drama. Then it makes sense. Right. Yeah, yeah. This last note here on that page is why I remembered about it. Ah, yes. It says here they are doing the meet and greet. Uh, Fortune Music. If you want to go meet Hinata Zaka. Only if you're in Japan. <laughs> yeah, the, the galaxy brain play for Hinata is to let all... Ooh, to welcome that's right. everybody. Uh -huh, uh -huh. That's how you make Hinata more popular. So you make him worldwide. And you know, like, oh man, Hinata's so cool. They could be like Pitbull. Foreigners who got banned. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But... Like, I can imagine the story already. The news covering it. Just like how they cover the, the NMB one. <laughs> They're going to cover this one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There we go. But, Let's get it. Uh, Hinata. We're too hopeful. <laughs> yeah, there's no way I'm applying. <laughs> I'd only want to see Kyonko anyway. Mm. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, they announced the fifth single at their second anniversary. Mm -hmm. uh, so let's check out some of the second anniversary stuff. We got some pictures. This is from the second day. Oh, okay. Um, because the first day was kind of like the Nogi stuff, right? It was like yeah. more talk. So I kind of like their outfits. Got like the uh, varsity See, look. Why don't they sell these? Look at the H on this yeah. one. They should have made those like the goods. <laughs> right? <laughs> like, Instead of the, the other one. The other one looks like a... He looked like a... What was it? Yeah, like U. It looks like a U. Yeah. But, I mean, the H... People might think it's high school, you know. Yeah. But I guess if it says Hinata oh. somewhere, then it changes things a little. No, because then all the oh, weebs yeah. are going to walk up to you and be like, yo, is that a Naruto jacket? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Um, oh, chat says the first day was actually the unit one. Where, oh, okay, um, okay. They had like fan club or, or Ohisama. Like, dude, mm -hmm. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't watch either day, so I don't know. Shit. I, I don't know either. Um, let's take a look at the set list real quick for the second day. We open with Azato Kawaii. We got all that katakana. Woo. <laughs> <laughs> so na koto na yo, and then do re mi. Mm -hmm. um, and then they ended with Joyful Love. Encore was Kyun. And then Seishin no Tamago 2020. Mm -hmm. And they had the last thing for the fan club, which was Hinata Zaka. There you go. What is, wait, what is that? Oh, yeah, they have a song called that, right? Yeah, they have a song. Yeah, just, yeah, yeah. Okay. just like uh whatever no does and shit like that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Shit. <laughs> I don't know anymore, dude. I haven't been keeping up. Oh my god. I haven't watched any of these concerts, so I'm like <laughs> So out of touch. Yeah, dude, I didn't watch it. So I don't know. Uh-huh. Um But yeah, yeah, there you go. You got the, the set list. There's some pictures here. Um uh, apparently, uh, Manamo came back, so that's cool. I think a lot of oh, people yeah, yeah. expected her to come back. Um, just like mm -hmm. when Matsuda Ko came back, uh, Hinako yeah, exactly. and stuff. Um, if I remember right, I think she came back early in the concert, right? Instead of like at the end. Matsuda Ko? I'm not sure. Chat, no, uh, Manamo. Oh, Manamo? Chat could uh, correct me if yeah, I'm wrong. Look at this second picture, man. Their like, legs are all taped up. <laughs> like, what's going on here? <laughs> no, I, I think that's just Kosaka. Oh, no. This, this one in the no, back dude. Here. Like... And uh, oh, one in the maybe back too, is, is is her legs are taped up. Oh, yeah, yeah, wherever this is behind Kyonko's legs are all taped uh -huh. up. I'm like, damn, dude. Um, Harsh rehearsal yeah. or something. Because <laughs> yeah, they yeah. have that uh, 
like as if they were actually doing the concert rehearsal beforehand. So maybe they were like oh, tired, yeah, like rehearsal. oh my legs are giving out. <laughs> Tape them up. Mm-hmm. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So chat saying Manamo came back at the beginning. So was she oh, there okay. the whole show? There's oh look at this is the old uh, Abunakashi Keikaku outfit. Oh yeah, it is variation. Uh huh. That's cool. Yeah. Um, you mean they were were they weren't wearing the jerseys the entire time? I don't even know when the jerseys were. <laughs> that could have been the opening. That could have been the ending. <laughs> I didn't but watch the I'm show. If I'm according to this timeline, you know, it kind of looks like yeah the beginning. Hmm. Um, mm, interesting. Yeah, so uh cool, cool. Some mm-hmm, nice mm-hmm. uh pictures over here. Um Okay, so they wore those old outfits when they performed Hiragana Kiaki songs. Cool. Oh, cool. okay, okay. I mean uh, I think I thought it was a shame to like let them just like be forgotten, yeah. you know. I'm glad they're back. Yeah, like people actually put in some work. You know, where do I buy these lumberjack harnesses? You know what I mean? <laughs> uh-huh. um, so, uh, yeah. Yeah, seems was put in. Might as well use it, right? On uh-huh, these uh-huh. outfits. I like some of the outfits, too. Those yeah, are yeah, nice yeah. looking outfits. Uh, yeah, so that's... Uh, are we accepting book club entries if it's an online concert? Nah, dude. Only personal experiences. <laughs> okay, only personal experiences. Okay, just making right. sure. Because then, like, you know... We're just watching a stream, bro. Uh, uh-huh. <laughs> Did someone like giving the TV show random? <laughs> or here's yeah. my here's my submission. You know, so um, <laughs> we'll, uh, when when concerts happen again, and y'all go attend, mm-hmm. uh, let let us know. We'll do a book yeah, club yeah. then. You know, because then you know you have pictures mm-hmm. and shit like that. Yeah. yeah. In the past, we've had a lot of like, I went to this concert. Here's how my experience went. Here's some pictures, and we have a little, a little sit down, little book club. You know. Yep. 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 Always welcome. So, yeah, that's he not the stuff. Um, maybe I'll catch the concert some other time. Nah, just kidding. I'll never watch it. <laughs> it's um, got forgotten. <laughs> nope. Just don't have the time. Right. So I, w- I wanted to, to watch it, but I couldn't. Yeah, let's move on to Sakurazaka uh, is what we would say if there was anything Sakurazaka related to talk about. Oh. Um, there would have juked been us. Juked the us. Tenchan uh, centered music video for Omota Yori Sabishi Kunai. But uh, they're testing out this premiere thing and it's going to air or it's going to start for us at 1 a.m. It's like almost 8 p.m. over here right now. <laughs> at this, we are not moment. waiting for that long. Um, We're not waiting five hours. There, there ain't no play button on this, you know. I can do the set reminder. <laughs> <laughs> so someone yeah. like can someone like give me give me the access code? You know, go in there, see the unlisted. <laughs> go to the. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so we got people waiting up in here. You know, mm, they're gonna um, wait all five hours. Just. Waiting, looking at the screen, you know, just waiting for that moment. Oh, yeah. I'll I'll just come back tomorrow and catch it when I wake up in the morning. Uh, Same. So unfortunately, for this week, not talking about Sakurazaka because that shit's way too late for us. Mm-hmm. So we'll catch it next episode. Jimmy yes. should be back by then. So that's mm-hmm. yeah, it just lined up better, I guess. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. So catch catch it next week. Um, there is a preview for one of the other B sides, but I'm good. <laughs> I didn't listen to it anyway. So. Nogi Zaka time. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on in Nogi Zaka? Well, oh. young Mukai Hazuki is in a stage play called Ari Jigoku. Jimmy's sister. Yeah. Um, Look at this picture. She's the queen of hearts. Oh. Right here. Uh, so there's like a, a, advanced ticket sales or something going on. Uh, oh, here's the description of 
the play, the novel Ari Jigoku, released in 2012 by Toshiyuki Itakura, established his fame, popularity, success in the comedy combination Impulse. Uh, okay, the story is set in a dark society such as a back casino. What? Aoki uh, Gahara Forest and Ruins with the same eyes and say, okay, whatever. Um, y'all can <laughs> read that something. up. It's, on, <laughs> it's about some. I thought it, it would get straight to the point of whatever the plot is, but it's, you know. Mm. Anyway. Yeah, let, me um, see. let me see what, what Deep L tells me. Uh, okay, while well, I read uh, the other stuff. Uh, okay. June 4th to 10th um, in Tokyo. So uh, good for her, you know, getting more work. Um, she doesn't it's show psychological. up on Nogichu that much no more, but she does have the Shogi show. So that's nice, even though I don't follow it. But uh, there's a message from Hazuki on the YouTube. It's about gambling. <laughs> oh, okay, so it's about gambling. There she uh-huh. is. The little message for you. Mm-hmm. Cool. Happy that she's getting some work. Yes, yes. Sustaining the, the Jimmy family. <laughs> she's, she's, she's the shouldering only one getting it. paid. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, there you go. Um, speaking of Hazuki, her generation, the third generation, will uh-huh. have their own concert, much like the first and the second. Mm-hmm. Um, and also the fourth gens are also getting their own concert. Um, this was... Uh, I think they they mentioned it already, right? That they yeah, were yeah, getting yeah. their own concerts. Mm-hmm. Um, it's going to be in May. Annoying. Fourth gen will be on the eighth. Third gen will be on the ninth. Um, Very so, convenient. Yeah, just like the first and the second, which I did not watch. Um, let's talk about that. <laughs> so let's let's talk about the first and second gen concerts that we did not watch. Um, so <laughs> the second gen concert was Hori's last thing with Nogizaka mm, um, sad days her grad concert pretty much and so I had all the second gens uh, all eight of them um, yeah and, and they did things they performed look at these pictures they have oh mm-hmm. yes let's talk about the set list <laughs> Anastasia and then Live Shin right those are second gen songs mm-hmm. Scout Man yeah that's oh. what I was looking for <laughs> <laughs> and then they did Anastasia again at the very end mm-hmm. as part of the encore okay hmm. before that Interesting. Barretta you know very uh, yeah that's you know that's a horror song uh-huh. Um, but they kind of like bookended it, which I think is pretty interesting. Like yeah, yeah. Anastasia beginning, Anastasia at the end. Mm-hmm. An interesting way to do it. Uh, overall, pretty good set list. Yeah. You got yeah, some yeah. hits there and some like second gen songs, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That second gen pride, even though management doesn't see it. <laughs> yeah. And they, they did Haruji on, so that's cool. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Nice. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna watch this one later. Yeah, from the pictures, look pretty good. Mm-hmm. Um, Hori at the end with her dress and stuff. Members gave uh, little messages, or mm-hmm. so it seems here on this article says uh, member specific songs. I didn't watch the show, so I I don't know if they like did the solo or if they centered these songs, right? Mm-hmm. So like Yamazaki Rena with the Kimi no Nawa Kibo and shit like that. Um, so maybe they chose these uh, and then they perform it. So that's cool. They centered yeah, the yeah. songs. Thank you, chat. Okay, they centered it? Okay, that's pretty cool then. If they like yeah, pick yeah. a song that they like and then they center it? Mm-hmm. Well, this article has like descriptions of probably the reasons why it's just all in Japanese. Mm. So <laughs> the Google, Google Translate, translate yourselves. <laughs> if you want to know the significance 
Um, but, but you don't want to hear No Gizaka, where we are, was created by the first gen members. <laughs> when we first joined, we were the first juniors. So I think there was a lot of confusion. I think there's a lot of confusion that we have by reading this too. Mm. Yes. <laughs> okay, there you go. Um, let's talk about the first. Oh, wait, no, before that. Um, so Miyano is gone. Um, she set up her own website. Mm-hmm. And then her blog is closing at the end of April, I think. Um, so the fan club is there or whatever. We were kind of talking about it on the pre-show a little bit. Um, there's a little message. You can join the fan club, uh, which is just her name backwards. Um, mm-hmm. How do I join? Mail address. What? Okay, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> well, the good thing is right now it's free. You know, it's free to join apparently right yes. now. We don't know if it's for a limited time. Well, it's probably for a limited time, based on. Do I click this? Click at Plus the Plus member ID. Or maybe just the registration's free. You know, but well, here's your registration. Everything else. So. Yeah. So I mean, um, they might say. I don't usually stuff, like join fan stuff, so I don't know. That's what I think. Yeah. Mm. I, I yeah I don't know what the perks are. You probably get yeah, like yeah. I think it's just like, newsletter stuff, and then like you get like, a, like uh, I think I was reading some of it. It was like you get access, but you have to put in like your your mail address and stuff like that. Mm, okay. Yeah, so you probably get you know usual stuff like messages and whatnot, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Maybe when things open up again, uh, events. So I usually don't. The only fan club I really joined was Perfumes, and that was to buy a shirt I really wanted at a concert. <laughs> oh, so. okay. So you're like, all right, bought the and shirt. I, like, I right. kept forgetting that I was a member, and it's like, hey, are you going to renew? I was like, oh, wait. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway. <clears throat> uh, let's talk about the first gen concert now. And I did not watch either, but here we are. <laughs> it's been... Uh... Every, a lot happened in a week. Well, I'll just say that. Yeah, man. I've been busy. Okay. A lot of stuff and not enough time. <laughs> Schoolwork's killing me. But anyway, mm-hmm. um, there are also eight members in first gen, and they did their thing. Um, it seems like they did like a pretty fun thing where each member produced a performance for another member. Yeah. Right. Like Manatsu performed out of the blue. With mm-hmm. a bunch of cats. This is like the Nogi version of cats. Look at them. <laughs> Look at them go. Who came up with this idea? Uh, I don't know who did. And then I think Kaz played piano because Iku Chan made her. <laughs> oh, interesting. That's cool, right? Uh, they challenged the piano. Mm-hmm, she mm-hmm. looked elegant right there. Uh, let's see what else we have. We have uh, Hikuchi performing Inochiwa Utsukushi. Oh. Gotta see that. Um, there's the, uh, this one, the 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 cute Ashu. That oh, that's what everyone's produced. talking about. <laughs> yeah. I saw parts of the performance. Mm-hmm. Um, and Manatsu was sitting off to the side. She had like signs. Do oh, this. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> during the performance. <laughs> yeah. So uh, I think, okay. Chat says that was payback. Because <laughs> mm. Asuka made Manatsu do out of the blue, I guess. Oh, interesting. This looks like a, like a fun like a fun set for sure. Yeah, yeah. Like it's not your typical. Maybe I'll, I'll just watch this segment. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'll just watch the you know the Manatsu segment or maybe the oh, mm-hmm. I mean the Ikuta so, segment. <laughs> looking at the set list, that part starts uh, on the sixth song. This 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 block right here. Um, mm-hmm. But yeah. Pretty cool line, uh, set list, say Fukuna Mannequin and stuff. Wait, is, uh, Girls oh, Rule is there? Okay, number 12. Girls Rule. They also do IC. Um, mm. So, yeah. What do you mean I see? I see. I mm. see. Uh, yeah, seems so, fun. Yeah. Definitely check it out. Maybe I'll catch that one. Yeah, yeah. Out of out of all the ones that happen, <laughs> you gotta see Miona like last words, you know, and then everyone crying as they're reading their letter. They're all ugly crying, you know. Miona's not my Oshi. She would have been, but she's <laughs> not. So, <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Uh, there you go. That that mm-hmm. was uh, Nogi first and second gen live report. Please leave in the comments if we missed anything. <laughs> they chat this. saying we should talk about Yan Chan because she addressed it directly. I guess. Oh okay. Uh, let me just go to the Nogi website real quick. So this is. Uh, I don't know much about what happened because I wasn't following anything when all this shit went down. But apparently Yan Chan was photographed uh, on a date with the Johnny's boy. Mm -hmm. Uh, They looked like they made a nice couple. Guy was looking steezy with his... uh, It looked like they were on a nice uh, date, you know. Let's go to the park. Let's walk around. You know, let's talk. Yeah, they walked around. Mm -hmm. Stuff like that. I'm looking for a blog right now. Hold on. Anyone have pictures of the uh, of the dates? I saw those on Twitter. They're just walking yeah. around. I, I think that's all they're doing, just walking around, sitting down. Some people went to the location and took pictures like it, which I think is kind of... Uh, I heard those were like the crazy Johnny Woda. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I feel like... I don't want to say I feel like. It's probably, it's probably crazy Johnny Woda who stalked him. And they're like, wait, mm. what? <laughs> He's with a girl. <laughs> And then they told Boonshun. <laughs> mm, interesting. <laughs> okay, where's the blog at? I gotta translate this. What did what did she say? In the, I don't know. <laughs> was she there, said was exactly. there anything of note? <laughs> I, I think it's pretty much just like, oh, sorry, I should have been focusing on Nogi Zakaso. I think that's the, the gist of it. Let me let me auto translate. Google, lend me your power. Can't translate this page. Can you uh, post it in the doc? Okay, hold on. One sec. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I wasn't prepared to talk about this, but chat wanted to. All right. Um, All right so pretty see. much she apologized. I mean, that's pretty standard fare, right? Ma B, I should have known better. I think someone on Twitter translated it. So if anyone has a link to that. Okay. Um, I don't have a link. I don't know. There were like a few scandals that came out around the same time. Yeah, I, uh, I think they're going after just, the Johnny Jr. people, and then like, yeah, people are just getting caught up in it. There's uh, some scandals on the Forty Eight group side, mm-hmm. um, but like this one was just like, <laughs> okay, okay. We're just here, I'll, I'll, I'll read. I'll read what what Deep L says about this. <clears throat> okay, I'm sorry for my rash actions when I should have been concentrating on the activities of Nogizaka Forty Six. To all the fans. I'm really sorry for always talking to you with warm smiles and telling you that I'm rooting for you, even though you have really helped me a lot. To the seniors of Nogizaka, who have always been so kind to me and who have always carefully built up Nogizaka 46 to this point, I'm really sorry despite the fact that this is an important time for Nogizaka 46. I'm really sorry to my fellow fourth term students who have been working so hard together for the past three years and at a time when we need to put in even more effort with the addition of five new members. I'm also very sorry to all the staff and people involved who have always supported us close by and for whom I should be very grateful. I met the person in the news report as a friend, and I regret that I acted selfishly when I should have been concentrating on the many jobs I received as Nogizaka46 and... Her name is just... <laughs> just Sayak Kanekawa. Um... I would like to work with sincerity and awareness so that I can regain regain your trust one day. I love Nogizaka 46 and I want to continue to do my best as Nogizaka 46. I am truly sorry. Hey, that was pretty all right translation. Not bad. But damn, she friends on that guy? Oof. Um, but I mean, she has to, kind of, right? Yeah, it's kind of like, it's just obligatory, right? Yeah, I mean, it's uh, sound like pretty standard standard fare uh, type of thing. Just yeah, say yeah. this. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you good. Go Man. date him again, just more carefully. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know? And, and you know, like, it, it, they're, they're people, so, like, obviously, like, that stuff happens all the time. Mm-hmm. It's just... Uh, I don't know. It's, it's, it's just the, the, the perception that some, some fans have. And they start complaining. Yeah, unfortunately. But yeah, they I should think, ignore those people, but you know. I think that's the problem. Um, yeah. I think I there's think not even a, a Renai Kinshi, like in the actual groups. It's just like, we just say it because the fans get a little crazy, you know what I mean? 
Yeah. <laughs> Go date who you want, bro. But I'm sure like most of the fans like are like, yo, you, you do your thing. But then there's yeah. the one, the, the few mi- minority, the vocal minority who are like just riling up a storm for, for no reason. I mean, like most, most fans support them. Right. Like I think on the, on the, uh, the pictures I saw on, on Twitter, like the replies were like, ah, oh, they look so cute together or whatever. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's most of the replies I saw too. It's fine. It's like, um, the, she's only like, she was only like a year old, younger than the dude or whatever. Right. So uh-huh. like, they're the same age and stuff. Uh huh. Uh-huh. Um, so yeah, most fans I think support dating like, or don't care. Uh-huh. I don't care. Just as long as it doesn't like, I guess, get in the way too much of the work. Right. Mm-hmm. We should make a video like that. If we go to Japan, just interview people. What do you think of this? Just interview a hundred people and be like, I think of Renai Kinshu. <laughs> um, yeah, but, uh, you know, whatever. I don't care. Standard, standard, <laughs> it's standard fare, you know, like. Whatever. It, it, it's it's going it, to, it happens, but even though it sucks. Shit happens, um, you know. I wish it wasn't that way. They didn't fire her and whatever, you know, they're like, yeah, just be chill. Yeah, yeah. Just lay low for a little, you know, just wash over everything. Be better about it in the future. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Just don't get caught, man. Look at your senpai. (laughs) Look at all them. They never got caught. (laughs) Uh Exactly. (laughs) That's exactly, that's probably exactly what they said. (laughs) Um, But whatever. Yeah, yeah. There you go. We talked about Yan Chen. Mm -hmm. Y'all happy? (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> At least it's not as bad as the the fucking AKB one, uh, like the the their new center or whatever. Oh yeah, like, like already 14. three days, <laughs> three days <laughs> drinking, <laughs> bruh. Three days in. like AKB can't even try to save her. You know, there's like yeah, photo yeah. evidence. Uh, just like <sighs> there's like <laughs> side of our hands. Let you go. Yeah. <laughs> um. Whatever. All right. There you go. That's it. All right. Well, we're gonna take a quick break. And we'll talk about the comment of the week and the TV show roundup after this. All right, welcome back from the break. All of you guys watching live got to be part of the mid show. And now we go into the comments of the week. All right. Yes. And this is Hello. the section where I go and cover a comment that happened on last week's episode or in a different video, whatever I feel like, you know, as long as the comment happened in the past week. And for this one, this is from the past episode. And this is from Marcelo okay. Nian. Oh, thank you for the comment, Marcelo. Uh, this one, uh, very, very nice comments, you know, very, very truthful. It says, thank you to Josh. Oh my for god. Consistently what the f- dragging this episode <laughs> into strange and amusing corners. Uh, <laughs> what? Every time every time you read it, it, it takes a turn. What is this? <laughs> That's it? That's it? Thank you. Thank you very much for your comments. <laughs> if you want to be oh the next comment my. of the week, go ahead and leave a comment. And maybe maybe I'll pick a different one next time. You never know. I have nothing to add. Absolutely nothing. All right. How about we go to the next section? (laughs) Thank you for the comment. Leave one. (laughs) Leave better ones that that don't praise Josh. Okay. Leave some of your favorite recipes. Maybe um, maybe leave some of those. (laughs) Yeah. Let's go to the next section. Here's the TV show roundup. It's the segment where you uh, recap and talk about the past week's regular TV shows from your Sakamichi series groups, Hinata Zaka, Rei, Masho, Soko, Soko Magatara, Sakazaka, and Nogizaka Kojichu. Uh, sometimes there are other shows that air this week, in the week that we watch, but I didn't watch anything else this week, even though Ohatsu, no, Otameshu aired, I didn't watch it. It's not Nogi Ego, you know, it's not the same. Yeah. Uh, maybe next time, huh? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So it's just the, the three regular shows this week. First up, Hiragana Oshi, pretty oh. much. Because we're continuing from last week's 
a thing where you know hiragana oshi the the um what is it blu-ray dvds came out and so they're like mm-hmm. revisiting a bunch of the segments that they had on hiragana oshi and they're replaying all out of the games but like not all of them are at the main like in the studio with audrey uh so they had to play games for a chance to be in the studio and so continue from last week um this we had a game where it's like a tug of war but instead they're pulling on a table in reference to the episode with uh Hiragana Oshi and the past episode with Tanaka. Tanaka, there we go. Them girls. Um, yeah, and you know, the stronger members win. Yeah, yeah. So, I watched up until this part, so I don't know anything okay. that happens after this. <laughs> um and so from with with the members who won from last week, we got like the eight or so members who end oh. up on the main studio. With Audrey, and then um, they play a, a a quiz game type thing, um, but they gotta find these like little cards around the studio that have the question. Um, but mm. there are also cards that don't have the question, and it's a random punishment. And so yeah, they they're like running around the studio. Oh, I found one. Nope, Azure. Ah, drink this. Mm, okay, okay. Seems like a fun episode. Um, and then the members, uh, like one of the questions was like, I forgot what the question was, but the answer was, is a member. Um, and so they're guessing all these members. And then Manafi was like, oh, Takamoto Ayaka. And they're like, ah, oh, no, that's wrong. The answer was Manafi. <laughs> they're like, oh, what? <laughs> uh, and so the, whoever did well in that game moved on to another quiz. But it's um, like the the Baka quiz one where they um, oh. rank. They're like ranked from one to five. And then if you answer a question right, you move up. Oh, okay, okay. Uh-huh. Anyway, Osushi wins the quiz and oh. she's the one who gets to promote the Blu-rays. <laughs> is, that what they, yeah. is that what they win? Yes. They win a uh, time to promote the Maybe product. they won something else. I just wasn't paying attention. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I looked up, Osushi won. I was like, okay, cool. There you go. That's uh, okay. Hina Ai this week. Um, I guess there are some cute Kosaka now moments. Oh, okay. Because you, okay. you know she doesn't usually act that way. She's pretty like reserved. Yeah, she's one of the chaos members who tears up the studio. Uh yeah. But uh, yeah, that that's pretty much it. Next up, Soko Magatara Sakurazaka. In this episode, which I forgot to do the write up on in our doc. They um they awarded the prizes, mm. the Tsuchi and Sawa prize to whoever won the prize. And let me think. One was Koike. Uh-huh. And she wanted stuff for her dog, Pom. Mm. And so they brought out all these like snacks and they were like really expensive. Um mm. it was like jerky. All natural like, like here's this wag you jerky. <laughs> yeah, it was like beef and stuff. And then, uh-huh. like, the hosts were like, yo, man, the dog won't be able to tell if it's <laughs> Kuroge Wagyu or whatever. Dude. Food it's is just, food. It's food, bro. And then, so, uh, you know, one of the hosts had to pay for that and it ended up being, like, over $100 or some shit like that. 10,000 Japanese yen. Mm. And then one was uh, Onuma. She wanted a tree. I think it was, like, was it, was it, Kuro, uh, was it a palm tree? I don't remember. It looked like it. Anyway, they bring out the tree and it's like freaking tall. And they're like, uh, "Uh, what the hell? How are we going to carry this? And one of them was like, yo, when I, when I looked at it online, it was, it looked like it was this tall. Maybe (laughs) I was going to put it by my couch. Uh (laughs) They bring it out. It's like, damn. (laughs) Uh, was Pawn wanted a washing machine. Oh, smart. Who else? Um, Shouldn't got a dryer, you know. Dryers got are progressive, very yeah. few in Japan. Yeah, it got progressively like the stuff they wanted got more expensive. I'm starting to remember now. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I wanted a base. It's kicking in, um, and so they brought out three, and then they're like, "Okay, one of these is like uh, it was like eighty thousand yen, like eight hundred dollars, something like that." Oh, 
Mm-hmm. And then Suchi had to pay for it. And then um, it was like, it was a, a Fender, it was a P-Base, and then two like not as well-known brands. So he's mm-hmm. looking like, God damn it, man. I know which one it is. <laughs> <laughs> and she ends up picking the Fender. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> this one felt the the nicest. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, okay. Like, Fuck, all right. <laughs> And then, uh, yeah, Pon wanted the washing machine. Uh, and then she picked, like, the second most. I don't know. I don't remember. But anyway, it got, like, the stuff got more expensive. Because mm. they brought, like, Rika wanted a couch. Okay. Um, there was one that, like, reclined. <laughs> uh, and, you know, those are more expensive. And then, like, Aoi mm. wanted, like, a purifier or something. I don't know. Oh, Okay. It's like household stuff, you know? Stuff yeah. that we'd be interested in. Yeah, right. <laughs> I was thinking like, remember, okay, I, I like these choices. Remember that Nogichu where Banana Man was trying to sell products? Yeah, this one's good right here. Oh, yeah, so, yeah. Uh, like the, the rice cooking and everything? Yeah, that's what it felt like. Oh, so, okay, um, okay. Seems like a fun episode. Yeah, maybe check it out. Maybe get ideas for stuff if you want to buy stuff. Uh-huh. You know, like, Boys, boy, how is that, that vacuum you bought? That was recommended. Oh, the one to Uemu? Yeah. Uh, it, it it was good, but I don't use that anymore. I give it to my parents. Oh, okay. Because I bought the stick one that looks more like a Dyson. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That one that looks like a gun. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That one's nicer. I like it more. Oh, okay. Um, okay. But the old one is, is good too. Very good. Um, so, Suchi knows what he's talking about. Oh, no, that wasn't Suchi, right? Yeah, that was Suchi. Okay, yeah, that was, yeah, yeah. Yeah. They, they brought out this dude to, like, talk about the products, but mm-hmm. Suchi was talking about it more. He's like, hey, <laughs> of man, course. give the guy <laughs> something to do. Uh-huh. We brought him out here for nothing. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, so, yeah, that was Sokosaku. Mm. Interesting. You didn't watch that? Okay. No, I didn't. Uh, then I did watch the next one. I did watch which this Which was one. pretty fun. Um, Miona's grad... It was the Nogizaka 46 Miona Hori graduation commemoration Things Left Undone special. Ooh. That is the full name of the episode. Uh-huh. And so, what is this, light episode. novel? Mm-hmm. So first they had like the second gen house party. Mm-hmm. Uh, second gen just being goobers. Being that was stupid. fun to watch. That was fun to watch. It just made me miss when we had meetups with like the SoCal guys and we uh-huh. just like have drinks and like uh-huh. make hot pot or like barbecue or, or takoyaki party and shit like that mm-hmm. had idle mm-hmm. stuff in the background damn covid those were the days <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah that was pretty fun they were being stupid um that karaoke going on and they're like oh i like that fourth gen shit and so they put yeah. on out of the blue <laughs> and uh-huh. Milano was like rips off her mask oh, yeah. oh let's <laughs> like, go joining it <laughs> starts dancing <laughs> Um, and then they do this stupid thing at the end of the psychokinesis song mm-hmm. where Miona does a dance and then the rest of them follow. Uh-huh. Um, they had Nabe. Yeah, yeah. And then they, they, they had some real talk, but they all, at the same time, they were like eating fries and nuggets. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think it's interesting how like they sat at the table and there were like plastic walls all around them as they were eating. And then, like, the right table. after, yeah. they go to the middle room <laughs> and you're just eating and talking in the yeah. same table, like, even closer to each other. <laughs> it's just like, why? <laughs> eating eating fries with chopsticks, you know how it uh-huh. is. Um, and then, yeah, they, they like, oh, let's give a message to Miona, but in uh-huh. increasingly louder and dumber ways. Kind of mozzarella game-esque. So they, they go around in a circle. And then uh, you go back to the studio, mm-hmm. and then they, like Miona wanted to challenge the the racquetball relay where they like juggle the ball and pass it to the next person. Because mm-hmm. uh, she failed, she sucked at it, and so uh, they challenged it again mm-hmm. with members who also sucked at it, and they got nowhere near her. Right, because <laughs> Miona was at the end. Uh-huh. Uh, and then they she tried it again with second gen, and then Ranze screwed it up. Mm-hmm. And then they try it with the uh, Banana Man, with Keychain and Millie Love. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was the Batsu Points thing. 
mm-hmm. uh, and with Banana Man in two attempts. Mm-hmm. Uh, she was able to get it done. That was a nice save by Shitara. He's like, oh, oh yeah, right. Shit. <laughs> yeah, but she launched it right, and then like they caught it. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then yeah, at the very end, there's the you know the usual talk. Mm-hmm. They uh, they talk about some of the moments Memories. they had, uh-huh. and then she gets the bouquet of flowers. Mm-hmm. If you're a Hori fan, you know of course watch. It. She has a lot of like good expressions. She oh yeah, yeah. Like, uh, you got to see <laughs> Hori like. Being Hori, right? Yeah. Like when they do the psychokinesis song, they like Yamazaki Rena is like really bad at it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's the one part where she just gave up. She's like, ah, shit. Uh, said- <laughs> and they're like, yo, look at this uh-huh. one. <laughs> Screwed it up for everyone. Uh-huh. Uh huh. That was a fun episode to watch. Yeah, yeah. So. Mm-hmm. More episodes like this. Let's get more of them just hanging out, you know? Having a good time. Yeah, you know. We're. At least we are. We're opening stuff back up. More people are meeting up. I don't know about Japan, but it doesn't seem like they cared about that shit anyway. <laughs> lockdown? What lockdown? <laughs> you can't um, have a lockdown here. I'm going out. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's TV yeah. Show Rana. That is the episode. And that's the end of the show. If you enjoy this episode, go ahead and subscribe so you can know when we release the next episode or you can even go on Twitch give us a follow maybe give us a sub if you want to support the channel and as we said in the beginning this is every Tuesday around 7pm Pacific time whether it's daylight or standard it's California it's it's America (laughs) but yes thank you all for watching catch you guys in the next one see ya bye